Eminem Roundup, myself come. Young BT. Sammy. Interview business. Got my G to come true. Enough respect for coming true, G, you know what it is. Long time business. So what we're saying is we're starting off with being new to the scene. Obviously you've only been here what a few months. Few months. Obviously you have not been here a few months. You've been in you've been in, you've been around the lead scene, you've seen the lead scene all your life. You, you you're of you're my age group, so you you've seen what I've seen of the scene and certain rappers and MCs and whatever. So what does it feel like being in the scene in twenty nineteen? After I've seen you, you're new to it, but you're not new to it if you get what I mean. I watched it for the last 10, 11 years, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. This year, so it's my time to step up in here. I've been writing for a long time. And if you listen to my music, it don't sound like I've been here for two months. It sounds like I've been here for two, maybe 10 years. Yeah. For my writing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My writing's always been there, but <coughs> I'll be honest, I never had the confidence to do music. I didn't like my voice. But then when you actually get in a professional studio and hear your voice back, it sounds different to what you think. I don't think no one likes their voice on it. On the phone or on the camera. You don't realise what the, the studio can do, the buttons, all them effects and certain mm -hmm. things, trust me. I oh, know, I know what you're saying. You know. So, what you're saying about new to the scene being like all the technology stuff, but cause look, look at the age we are. We're not from fucking Spotify, YouTube, this and that. We had MySpace and MSN, nigga. Yeah, you get me? Let's be real. So, be but there you go, brother. So, coming into this world where you've got Spotify, this Apple Music, this iTunes, this. Google Music, this, this, this and that. I think what it's easier now with technology and social media for people to get recognised. Yeah, it's yeah. harder because everyone's doing it now. It's easier for everyone. It's not as easier for me, you and every other artist. It's easier for every artist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anybody yeah, yeah. can jump on social media and be a rapper now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or post yeah, yeah. a video in their bedroom, in their car and get noticed from it. Yeah, yeah, We're yeah, in our age. Yeah. We can do that. We didn't have all this social media. Man, had to, man, had, man had to run up in house parties. We had to go to house parties and then do shit like that. You get what I mean? I was stood in the middle of fields in yeah. in where in Tingley and them places, hundred man. Yeah, yeah, it's true, you know. You know Clashing by the them things there now. Nah, nah. off because police are coming and that. it's not like that now. Yeah, you know, it's real, it's real. So cool. So the first track you've dropped, obviously you've got tracks out written. You've got you've dropped previews on your Instagram. You've told people what's coming, but the the one that's out there that's that's making noise. King of the Hill TV, you know this, what you're saying about that? That's just a little freestyle, it's not even a fully track, it's just a freestyle saying I felt in my heart, I just had to say some truth to let people know like what level I'm on, like lyrics wise and let people see insight to my mind and how I write, but also it's true facts of what I think of the scene right now, a lot of people took offence to it, a lot of people showed love for it, but more time the lovers overpowered the offence side of it. Which has been received well for me, and people tend to push more, make more. I've got a good 13, 14 songs ready, but I'm just waiting to make videos. I don't want to be an artist that has dropped song after song. I want to hit them with video after video. Song after song don't really go down all the time. I want to give them something to watch as well as listen to. So, who do you rate in the scene if there is anyone, whether they're young, old, whether they're in this city or not, fam? Uh, let them know the movements you're making out of Leeds as well, other than just in Leeds, innit? You know what? There's a lot of people I rate, but the one person I'm focusing on right now is a female artist, believe it or not. I don't know if you have heard of her, she's called No Lace, she's from London. Come on. She's the no coldest. Lady. She's the better one of grime for the females. Her, her lioness. Them lioness, them, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because man, no, they made the blood. Un unorthodox. So, I had a on. little bit of come contact on, with her. So hopefully something can arise from this. Yeah, shout out Nole. You get me, you're getting shouted out up north. As for the male out, sides of things and other artists, I'm just trying to build myself and my platform and my stage. So you know what it is, fam. Um, you've come in, you've come in, not so late. You've come in at the time you wanted to and the time you needed to. But you've come in at a time where there's no point trying to make sure you get that collab or work with that man like you say focus on yourself in it like it's 2019 and you've seen how the music scene is now so this wh whether you was in a crew or not or whatever even down to just working with a man and making sure you get that song done with my man like you said but uh, work on yourself in it man you, mm. you get me you know i work with anyone in any artist i'll collab with them you're not booed you when man hit your dm that's what you're no, saying no exactly. i can work with but people but that's right what i'm now, saying that's, myself, innit? yeah that's what i I'm have a couple say. artists that you don't know and I'm not really going to expose the thing, but man have approached me. I've sent my song, if you want to jump on this, you want to jump on your thing. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. right now I'm trying to build me in it. And that's, that's the truth. 
give him your instas and your snapchat so they can find where you can um, spell it out as well snapchat so. young bt1 so y-u-n-g bt is the number one there my instagram is young bt official young underscore bt official i don't have twitter on that because <laughs> no, 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 I hear that. Some man is too technical to have all five Twitter's social media. One. You just need you. Twitter's for mad professional things, that's what I'd say. It's for proper, proper big companies and things. But I'm check this out. Facebook thing is oh, okay. Nathan Young BT. I have a side link from artist pages connected to that one page there, so find that you'll find both. My guy BT, introduce your guy, let him know, let people know what, what involvement, why he's here, why he's. Right. Guy right here. This guy right here, he's my manager, my best friend, he's the person that's pushed me to do this, so all this music that you lot are feeling, like showing me love for, he's responsible for really. Maybe not like lyrics wise or flow wise. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No yeah. ghostwriting, no ghostwriting business. He inspired me for this. <laughs> like, he will tell you, come work in the studio in five minutes, put me with these guys right now, and I'll make a song in five minutes, all verses done. That's it, but he inspired me to do this. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't even be here. Pick up you, boy. Do you want to say anything for the camera? Do you want to... Anything? I'm good. Unless you've got any questions. What do you want to say? What do you want to...